Easy enough, found that. Give me that bracelet. So I have, oh man, what, whose bracelets do I have? Oh, wait, 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 I gotta, gotta go through. I got Mila's and I have Aiden. So is that Silas running around? Or did they just take off their bracelet? Like, does someone have Silas's bracelet? Because, yeah, just because it's a, they don't have a bracelet doesn't mean they're not here. Life support system in Section A3 are currently offline. Exterior damage detected. Access restricted until maintenance robot is deployed. Man, we really need to deploy that maintenance robot. Oh, yeah, let's check this out. No. I don't even know which one it would be. And it has little symbols on it. I'm guessing... No, because you can't even see the outside. Oh, God. No! It broke! Crap. Content scan reveals damaged components. Functioning components will react to magnets... Oh, okay, got it. That's what the magnet is for. Let's grab this sucker. Functioning components will react to the magnet. Okay, so I don't even know what these components are, but I have two of them. I don't even know. Like, can I pull it? What is this? Um, okay. Oh! No, no, no. Oh, I'm guessing it goes in this, in, into his core, so let's put that down. Can I grab it? Maybe down towards his middle. Nope. All right. Well, let's see what's going on here. Can tell me anything else? Replace the E40 voltage regulator. I don't even know what that is. I mean, just I just got lucky on that one. Voltage regulator, huh? I don't even know what the voltage regulator would be. Alrighty. Maybe I'll, let's use the magnet one more time. Maybe there is something over here I haven't. Nope, nothing. You just I feel like what are that what are those things called the little um, metal detectors that you use on the beach in order to find like a uh, a key or you know metal in the sand <laughs> That's what it feels like let's just touch everything oh wait yeah there's a power thing let's go put this baby back I don't know why I feel responsible like I have to put it back where it goes let's mess with the power what can we do with this? Let's see what this does. Oh, there's a thing up there. And now, is it only accessible if I do that? No. There's an office or something up here. Let's see what's over here first. This is probably where the other pieces I need. Maintenance office. Access granted. Valid IBD. Oh, okay, so we, yeah, we got the uh, bracelet for Aiden, so we're good now. Fire suppressor. Decommission maintenance access room. Okay. Well, let's hear what's going on here. So do you think you can build it? <laughs> Not sure where you think I can hide something like this on board. There's a blind spot in the cameras in the upper deck hallway. Right here. It's possible. But uh, 
Given the risk, it's gonna cost you. Not a problem. I'm sure it will go to a good cause. Owen, oh, don't let her catch you. We're setting up cameras? Like secret cameras? What in the world is going on here, guys? There's only three of them, so they're setting up for Mila. Uh, Sadio Engineering. Over two months ago. With respect, it is not recommended that we make the suggested repairs and modifications to this vessel. The cost would be nearly the price of the station brand new. We advise you to consider termination of this project. Axiom to Sa Sadio. Thank you for your recommendations. Can all repairs be completed on schedule as discussed? Uh, Sadio says, completion can be expected on the date agreed, but management wishes to express that we won't be able to sign off on any warranty. Because of the station's current condition and the nature of the repairs, Sadio will be held will not be held legally accountable for any future complications. Oh, so they were being cheap, and that's probably what happened to this dang uh, space station. It fell apart because they were using cheap, you know, old-school stuff. After the warp jump to Psy Prime, a large portion of our spare parts were discovered to be fried. The damage appears to be from electromagnetic radiation, so it, it's looking like another unexpected result of moving something as big as the SPL with the enhanced singularity drive. Makes you wonder what the public support for the mission would be if they were aware of how many unknowns there are on our side. Feels like we're figuring out most of this as we go along. Yeah, they probably- okay, so this they've never done it like this, okay. I don't know where- oh, there's a camera there. And it follows you! Awesome! So someone's watching me. Operating at full capacity. Full rotation available. Operating at full capacity. Okay. So I don't see any other parts up here. Other than they uh, decided to put a camera up for whatever reason. Oh, wait a minute. Now it's working? Wait a minute. Now it works? All right, so I guess let's keep pulling these pieces. So we find a good uh, thing. Oh, there you go. I just totally guessed at that one. I know it's probably, you guys are probably going crazy in the comments. Just screaming at the screen going, it's right there. Wait a minute. Functioning? Components will glow when not under direct lighting. Oh, okay. That's what the power is for. They will glow. Now we get to get the one that's glowing. What the crap is that? That scared the crap out of me. What was that? Dude, jump scare. Holy crap. Get that in there. Scary. That's so creepy. Oh, he's fixing himself. Um. What the crap? He just go through the window? Okay. Life support systems repaired. Okay. That was scary. That was really scary. <laughs> what was in here? Something was going on. Alright, well, we can get in the life support now. If I had to guess, I'd say we've been hit by something. Trouble is, I can't tell for sure, because whatever did happen took everything offline. Engines, cloaking, communication... I get it, Aiden. We need to fix this. Now. I'm on it, but I have no idea how long this might take. Then let me remind you of what will find us if you don't hurry. Oh. Freaking out because the aliens are gonna find us. 
Nothing going on here. What is this? Is a whole like like hospital basically? Wow, this is what I'm guessing where Silas goes. The local star emits a light spectrum with a comparatively longer wavelength than our own. The species' eyes have developed to process and see colors that we cannot. Specifically, the retina can process light at 400 nm to 700 nm, but not the lower end of our visible light spectrum of 300 mm. Okay, that's kind of weird. Eye study. Okay. Uh, no mail, but we have notes. Aiden Weiss. Title, Senior Engineer. Medical diagnosis, Aiden meets the minimum health requirements for Axiom space travel. Active career of CSAD, no observed symptoms that would deteriorate his ability to perform duties. Comments. Weiss meets all health requirements and is cleared for the SPO mission. His CSAD carrier status will not impact his job performance, but given CSAD has an extremely high mortality rate, we recommend that he be regularly screamed host mission. What's he going to get? He's, oh, he's going to probably have some kind of weird illness. I am reporting a work-related injury. Okay, Mila. Name of injured employee, Silas. Mission day 12. Where did the injury occur? Upper lab, central work table. What caused the injury? Silas was being careless while manually dissecting a sample retrieved from the surface. He cut his hand. What part of the body was injured? His arm. I'm concerned this will compound his already inadequate physical competency. <laughs> okay. What could have been done to prevent the injury? Oh, this definitely sounds like some kind of corporate uh, form you have to fill out. He could have acted like an adult and be more aware of what he's doing. What actions have been taken? Aiden has treated and dressed the wound. Recommending we dock pay for the subsequent loss of efficiency Silas will experience during recovery. Should also consider further reprimands. Okay, I think Mila is just trying to mess with him because she doesn't like him. She's pissed off. To dock your pay because you got hurt? <laughs> Side prime species overview. The species is a psychological bilateral, water-dependent organic omnivore possessing an advanced emotional and intellectual capacity. Oh, if they they can't read though, obviously. <laughs> the former primary dominated by fear. It's perceived their violence stems from underdeveloped social cognitive learning structures and systems. Inefficient individual knowledge retention and processing. All right. Luna media. Okay, that's a whole, whole bunch of scientific stuff. Can I get in here? No? Oh, let's listen to this one. We were prepared to do little more than chemically converse with single-celled organisms and now disrespect our subjects by proceeding as if they were. What cruelty we show our cosmic siblings by denying them the knowledge that we exist. All right, see, let's calm down. Can I go in here? Nope, I guess not. It's locked. Alright, nothing in here. Oh, wait. Okay, you got a fire suppressor, but I can't use it. I'll throw that at the fire. If there's ever a fire, I'll just throw it over there. Let's go to the bridge. Emergency lockdown enabled. This is the S-File to Axiom. We've been discovered. An alien ship is attempting to dock. We're initiating lockdown and preparing for evacuation. Gentlemen, this mission is over. Back up all mission data and then get to the escape pod. Mila, they're boarding. We're done here. What? Both of you, move. The aliens boarded? So that's an alien that's coming here? What? When did that happen? When did, when did that recording happen? When did they record that? It doesn't tell you a time. Whoa. I think they're still Explosion here. Detected in the lower lab. 
I think they're still here. Like, did they just record that like 10 seconds ago? Whoa, that is a lot of uh, space. I think they're still here. That's why I can, can hear them. Okay, that's the, that looks like a docking area. An email from uh, Eli, Elias to Mila. Leadership is pleased with your team's speed on achieving mission deliverables. Based on your reports, we anticipate being a full six days ahead of schedule, which provides us with a unique opportunity. Attached is a, char a charter for a new project your team is to prepare for. Attachment deleted. What? Oh man, we're going too fast. Okay. This was never discussed in the mission scope, and it had it had it been, I never would have accepted command. What could have possibly changed for leadership to even consider this? We've only properly analyzed a fraction of the data collected. I think it goes without saying that we really have no clear idea what we're dealing with yet. Once we see a more complete picture of the situation, we'll be in a more informed position to determine the next step. And then he emails back to Mila. The first priority is the safety and welfare of our people. Based on the turbulent reports of the aliens' behavior, there's mounting pressure to demonstrate a degree of control. I'll also add the exorbitant cost of the SPL mission requires Axiom to exceed expectations of stakeholders. It is an objective that requires everyone to follow a chain of command, and while you have a famous last name, I expect you to obey orders. What did he ask her to do? Uh, sibling rivalry. It's the disconnected and fragmented nature of the species that I find myself drawn to understanding. We can identify geographically based on super clans formed in all quadrants of the planet, and the species fight viciously to defend their cultural identity. They almost look to create arbitrary division between themselves. Despite the fact that, from my preliminary test, they are 100% identical in nearly every way, it's sibling rivalry on a planet-wide scale. Sibling rivalry on a planet-wide scale. Docking bay is open. Why is it open? Upper hallway. Okay, yeah, this is where we were. So let's go down here. Can't go into Mila's office. Why not? Going to the lower hallway. What is going on down here? Find Celis's ID bracelet to access the upper and lower lab. Oh, we're getting creepy sounds here. I like how they have viewing rooms. That's pretty cool. And the floor. That's pretty cool. All right. Violence can be segmented into either instinctual or intelligent categories of behavior. Instincts can be tamed while intelligence can be subjected to reason. The problem is we can't tell which one of these is the cause of their violence. Okay. Thermal and radioactive decay signatures show that we're not observing a brief moment of war, but contextually it appears to be a persistent practice. Their war is unbelievably fascinating to watch. It's unclear precisely what the catalyst is, and at this point it doesn't even matter. The outright savagery demonstrated is unparalleled. Wow. Alright, so they're at, like, worldwide war. Can I get in here? Conference room? It's really dark in here. All right. Mila, is this some kind of joke? Where are all the pins? Aiden, you should ask Silas if he's hiding them. That sounds like something he would do. Wow, okay. Wow, every motivation ends in conflict? <laughs> wow. Oof. Someone's a cool little artist. I like that. Making a card. Let's see if I can take it down. Done, son. All right. What is this one? Curiosity is the very basis of exploration. 
So if you tell me that curiosity killed the cat, I should think that cat died rather nobly. Okay, Silas. Or Silas or Silas? I don't know. I keep pronouncing it differently every time. Mission to observe an alien civilization. They have an engineer, a researcher, a captain. They do not have a diplomat. Very good point. Scrum notes. Mission day 17. Geological report. Outstanding con content assigned to Silas. Completion ETA. Conflict and warfare reporting. Ordnance and munitions analysis assigned to Aiden. Doctrine, strategy, and tactics assigned to Mila. Aiden, you can't drink during regular hours. <laughs> Aiden, drink less during regular hours. <laughs> okay, let's see what's going on here. What Axiom chooses to do in the future missions is their prerogative, but once this mission's remaining original objectives are complete, the SPL and its crew will be returning. That's my final word on the subject. Uh, Elias to Mila says, Your decision is regrettable, Mia. Mila. The board will issue their response shortly. Whoa. Yeah, they really wanted her to go after it, I guess. Two different pieces, okay. Got all that. Cannot get into Mila's office. We need to get Silas's uh, key, his bracelet. Can't get in the hangar. Oh, we can probably. Let's let's explore around a little bit here because I think the hangar is like, what is that? The hangar seems like a, a far off place, like something later on. This seems dangerous. Please deal with it. I'm pretty sure this is just one of many lovely features of the SPO. Okay. What? What was dangerous? Go to medical? Oh! Here we go. This was what I was trying to get in here before. I see a sink with uh, all that. Oh, that door opens now. Mila, please wait a moment. Get out of my way. I just wanted to talk. You made your choice, Silas. Man up to it. Okay. Silas. Not Silas. Silas. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I think we've already been over here. Medical. Bridge. Oh yeah, we did. We came from there and I just stopped there. I didn't realize there was another door over here. It was probably locked. I probably couldn't get in this one anyway. Yeah, there's a lot. This whole station is huge. I need his bracelet. Escape bot, stand by. Stand by. Stand by. Okay, so nobody took their escape pod. It's still on standby. So where is everybody? If they didn't escape, where do they go? All right, we need to go back downstairs because we had the other door we could go into. Engineering. Hey. Silas's room powers offline. Okay. This doesn't look scary at all. This seems like it would be a bad if I mess it up. Hanger. There's a whole bunch of just wire just hanging out. What in the world, you guys? Aiden, to do. Finish moving the rest of fuel cells from hangar office to engineering. Oh, we need more fuel? Okay, Oop, that's orange. I don't know what orange means. All fuel cells must be active and properly calibrated to enable control. Insert fuel cell to begin calibration. Nope. 
The first set of drones returned with the sediment samples, but two were damp. Are you drinking? Uh, no. I'm rescuing what's trapped in this bottle. Well, are you gonna share or what? Have a seat. <laughs> Have a seat. All right, I'm guessing orange goes in here? There you go. Oh, crap. I think I saw those symbols. All right, I'm guessing this over here. So we have to match this up to the ones down there. Got it. I think I can do this. We're going to find out. That one? Crap. <laughs> I already messed it up. Okay, no, it's quarter to the to the right on the inner and all the way to the left. And then up down and then down to the right. Okay. So let's reset this thing. That one? Up down. And then, well, wait, I don't have it. That symbol's not here, I don't remember. What the? It was up, down, and then... Up, down, and then to the right, down. Oh, wait. That? Up, down. And then to the right. It's not here. I don't see the symbol that I need. Seriously. Hole on the right. And then hole on the bottom. Am I just not seeing it because I'm that dumb? Oh, yeah, it's right there. Duh. I think that is for this one. Yep, that goes to that one over there. Now, I think I need a charged battery for this. So I got to charge a battery. Um, and he said it was an engineering. I have to bring another charge battery from engineering in here. Come on. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. 